Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It's Arsenal up against Sporting. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays with Thomas Partey in central midfield. And the main forward is Gabriel Jesus. Well, he must get rid of the ball. Morita. Manuel Ugarte. Now with Esgayo. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent. So what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, the danger is still there. Fruitful looking attack. Oh, great defending. Ugarte Hidamasa Morita and taking it away William Saliba Shaka oh a perfectly timed pass keeper did his job to begin with and the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger Ricardo Escayo. Now with Edwards. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. A chance to whip it in. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. Who can they pick out? Well, not quite the corner he had in mind. Goalkeeper has it. Might really be able to trouble them here. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Nuno Santos. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalves. And Sporting looking creative here. Well, he's lost it. Martin Odegaard. How can he take them on and beat them? And options in the centre.
Well, the stats don't lie. It's been very tense and an even battle so far, but neither side has played with enough quality to pose a real threat going forward, and that needs to change. Gabriel Jesus. Can they take the lead? Oh, goodness me, off the post. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0 here. Well, what about this? He reacts brilliantly. He's so sharp there. That's a very good goal. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. The ball moving once again, and Sporting now, they've got to come up with a few answers in the second half. Could cross it in here. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Bukayo Saka. And plenty of positives in the first half where Martin Odegaard was concerned. What did you make of his contribution? Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Plenty of options, but nothing comes of it. Martin Odegaard. Ben White. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Can he keep his composure? Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. And they will make the change now. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Our possibilities inside the box. Really vital interception here. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Edwards. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalez. Marcus Edwards. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Martin Odegaard and a poor ball can they hit on the break might be dangerous oh good save there to win it back well what a good piece of goalkeeping that was but the equaliser can't be long in coming surely well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now danger averted for now but they have a corner to defend and a double substitution it's going to be number 34 to be a great number 3 and number 20, Jorginho. It's a short corner. It's one corner after another.
delivering it and he clears the danger Martinelli using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball he must finish and a goal they lead by two now and that allows them to breathe a bit more easily Well, it's great awareness of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish that's a clever goal So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Arsenal have given it away. But well, it comes down to the final five minutes. Could be a chance to break here. He's left his marker for dead. Can he find the angle? And snuffing out the danger. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Giving it a try. And now it is official. The referee brings this match to an end and it's a victory for the Gunners. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, Jorginho certainly knows his position and knows how to bring his influence to bear on a game, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today. And they kick off here. 